As you know, this is primarily a directed reading course, and it's a. This is also an experimental electronic course, and so one of the things that I'm going to be experimenting with is helping you engage with some important thinkers uh, in the area of ethnic studies, uh, which include Rogers Brubaker, by not only providing you uh, the um, electronic versions of his many books and articles that you would benefit from reading, but also linking these with YouTube videos that would help you help you uh, get familiar with the general um, his general ideas, his general arguments, his general research interests. Remember when you watch a YouTube video, make sure that you turn on the button that says CC. You can choose your subtitles. Remember in the settings you can change things like you can slow down the speed. So begin to be using YouTube as a tool for learning, not a toy. Remember, you will not pass an exam, you will not write a good paper, and you certainly will not write a good thesis by watching YouTube videos. The only reason we have them is to achieve this purpose. And what is the purpose? The main purpose is that you begin to read. Remember, when you are reading books in PDF version, you are able to right-click and then translate words. You're able to highlight the words that you don't understand so you can translate them later. You're also able to copy uh, entire sections into uh, a program that will read it to you. These are important functions. So, for example, we are going to be reading some from these pages. For example, I could choose a paragraph. I could choose that, and I could copy, and I go to um, my browser, and I go to Google Translator, and I can put that in there, and then I can... Having surveyed the work done by you won't be able to hear this, but indicated some limit of this and is now reading uh, to me. So we are going together to interact a bit with the work of Rogers Brubaker, who is not an easy person to read. And I, I realize that if you are not a native speaker of English, you are going to find this challenging, and you will probably need to be reading this more than once, and you are almost certainly going to have to pause and to translate words and maybe even ask people to help you. So we are going to be, um, particularly, we are going to be uh, interacting with this chapter two of this book called uh, Ethnicity Without Groups. And chapter two is called Beyond Identity. Now, I will actually be, um, this chapter was previously published in a journal. And uh, I will be reading through the version on this journal. I will be reading the, the journal version, not the version in uh, the book. And so uh, let's um, begin to do this together now.